What is up, ladies and gentlemen? We are back here for yet another episode, and uh, as you guys can tell by the title, we're going to be doing the April Mystery Tackle Box unboxing, and uh, so far I've already been uh, looking through a couple of the baits in here, and uh, looks looks like a pretty stinking good box, but before I get carried away with that, uh, I want to make a big announcement that the giveaway winner will be uh, drawn on this Sunday, Sunday, April 15th. Um, that's that's like, I think, like five days from now. Um, so it's coming up very quick, so make sure to smash that subscribe button. And uh, also, the giveaway link is down in the description, so go check that out. And uh, yeah, and then I want to make another announcement that Legendary Baits has come out with the brand new uh, 38 series uh, football jig heads. Um, 38 means 3 eighths of an ounce, so they are a little bit heavier and they're a little bit smaller. So you can still you can cast them on a bait caster if you like that, or uh, what I'm going to be doing tomorrow or the next day is casting them on a spinning rod, and uh, they will still they're kind of smaller. Um, so they're perfect for uh, those hot summer days coming up very soon for us southern dudes, hopefully, um, when the fishing is tough. And uh, for you northern dudes, throw them out on rock ledges, bring them back, you are good to go. Make sure to go check those out down in the description. Link is down there, legendarybaits.com, um, or you can look us up. And uh, those things go for a three pack for only two bucks. So very cheap plus shipping and uh, now we will get on in today's video. Alright guys so getting on into the box we've got the little double di digest here which is just a uh, like a little fishing magazine um, it's got some tips in it that, uh, that has to do with some of the baits that are in the box um, it kind of tells you how to fish them some ideas on how to uh, rig them that maybe not everyone knows um, and, uh, and then you've also got, on the flip side, is the what's in your box little card with all the prices, names, and everything. So I'm going to be looking at that to go over today's box. And uh, the first bait is we've got the Bagley Pro Sunny B Twin Spin. So starting off the bat with a mouthful of a bait. But uh, this one, I've been looking at this for a little bit, and uh, this bait looks really nice. Uh, if you guys don't know, Bagley baits are all made whoa, all made out of uh, like a certain type of wood. Uh, I can't quite remember what type, but they are uh, they are kind of fragile whenever you bang them up against rocks, so you don't want to do that. Um, but again, it's got an awesome paint job right there, very detailed. And uh, if you guys don't know what prop baits are, it's just like a topwater walking bait, but it like these little prop baits right here, those things spin, cause up a little bit more commotion than a normal topwater bait would be. And uh, I've actually never thrown a uh, prop bait. I, I bet I haven't. I don't think I have, um, especially in a video. So that will be a, a cool one to use. And uh, bait number, oh, and that bait goes for $13. Uh, bait number two is the Biospawn Exo Swim. So these are very similar to the uh, Kitek little uh, swim bait deals and uh, these baits go for six dollars and uh, really cool little color deal right there half of it is blue and half of it's white so pretty cool little uh, paddle tail swim bait you can throw this on a normal swim bait hook or uh, whatever floats your boat so the next bait in the box is the stickies uh, spinnerbait hook which is like uh, mystery tackle boxes like hook brand uh, it's just a normal little uh, trailer hook right there for a normal spinnerbait pretty cool little deal again just a uh, general little thing for a spinnerbait um, and then you guys should probably know that a spinnerbait comes after a trailer hook and that is the Catchco Pro Series Spinner Bait. This bait goes for, I believe, six dollars. Yep. And uh, this, I've also been looking at this bait a little bit, and uh, it's pretty cool. I can definitely catch a fish on this sucker. But uh, pretty cool little spinner bait. Again, just a normal uh, little shad pattern. 
And uh, this bait does seem a little bit heavier too. So I don't know if it's made, I don't think it's made out of lead or uh, tungsten, but pretty cool little spinner bait. And, all right guys, so getting on to bait number five, we've got the Big Bite Bait Limit Maker. This bait goes for $2.35. And I actually had a idea uh, for whenever I do my MTV slam is to put this sucker on a on the back of my uh, spinner bait for kind of like a, a little trailer because this this would be an excellent bait for drop shotting but uh, this bait this month's box didn't come with drop shot stuff so uh, I want to do what I can but and then the sixth bait is the lucky John uh, what is that called? Uh, chunk tail. This bait goes for four dollars. This is a, uh, a little grub, and a pretty cool little grub. But uh, it's also pretty standard. You can also throw this bait on the uh, on the back of the spinner bait as well. And uh, it's just got it's, it's almost like a darker gray kind of thing uh, with some gold flakes in it. But that bait goes for four dollars. And then let's see the next bait is the Castaic uh, Boy Ducket Crankbait. This is a uh, 4.0. This dives to 4 to 6 feet. And uh, you guys have got to see how big this crankbait is. Uh, talking about a big square bill, eh? Yeah, it's uh, it's pretty stinking big. <laughs> um, it's, it's about uh, half the size of my hand. I, th I think a little bit more than that. And uh, it's just in a standard white color, but uh, this is going to be a, a good challenge bait because I've never used a square bill uh, that big. I've only, I think the only other bait is either the, my, my last video is like a big swim bait challenge or something like that, or a, a deep diving crank bait. And then the last but not least bait is the, uh, or actually it's not a bait, but it's the uh, Owl's. Uh, goldfish lure company uh, these are little hook covers or treble hook covers uh, for crankbaits and uh, I've, I actually have some of these not by this company but uh, I think I bought them at Bass Pro and uh, you just put them on a uh, treble hook right there and uh, they just cover it up so you can put like multiple uh, crankbaits in one Pouch and you don't even have you can even put them in like uh, like your pocket and they won't get hung up and then we've got the uh, the cool little sticker right there but uh yeah that is all that came in my mystery tackle box pro all right guys so I hope you enjoyed this uh, April mystery tackle box unboxing again it came packed full of pack, uh, baits and if you guys want one of these boxes for yourself the link is down in the description I'm not paid by MTB, not sponsored by MTB, just love their products. And uh, also, my sister has a YouTube channel as well called Bethy Girl Vlogs. Um, I'll put it in big capital letters across my face, but it's Bethy, B-E-T-H-I-E, space girl, space vlogs with a V, like V, L, O, G, S, <laughs> pretty much. But uh, it's, again, it's going to be all across my face. Link it will be down in the description as well. So make sure to go hit her up with a uh, subscription. But anyways, guys, thank you all so much for watching. Make sure to smash that subscribe button on mine. As well as go check out Legendary Baits. And uh, we will be posting some uh, videos up on that channel as well here very soon. But anyways, guys, thank you all so much for watching. And uh, we will catch you all on the next episode of LMB Nation. Peace, guys.